In this video, I want to talk about how to make a pie chart in Excel. So first, let's increase the width of these two columns. And let's use the expenditures of a company. Let's say advertising expenditures, research, and let's see what else, payroll, utilities, and also for the purchasing department. So let's say the expenses for advertising is 15 million. I'm going to write 15. And then for research, let's say it's 25, payroll 10, utilities 5 million, and purchasing, let's say 20 million. Now to make the pie chart, click on the top left corner and then with the left button of your mouse, drag it until you encompass both columns. And then click Insert, and then you can see the pie chart here. Now you could do a 2D pie chart or a 3D pie chart, but let's start with a 2D pie chart. Now, if you want to, you can expand the size of the graph. You can make it a lot bigger. And then you can add data labels to it. If you click the arrow on the right, it could be at the center, the inside. I'm going to choose data callout. And then the legend, you could change it from being at the bottom, and you could push it to the right side if you want to. And then we could title the chart. So let's make the pie chart. Let's call it company expenses. And of course, you can increase the size of this. Let's make it uh, 18. Now, if you want to change the background color, right click the chart area, and then using the fill option, you can make it red, you can make it green, blue, you can make it gray if you want to. But let's keep it white for now. But that's how you could change the background of the pie chart. Now you can also change the color as well. You can choose different colors. If you don't see the color that you want here, there's more options that you could use. So if you go to page layout and then colors at the top left, there's some other colors that you can use if you want to. So let's use this one. And then when you're done, you could just click anywhere on outside of the graph. And so that's how you can change the color if you uh, want to. Now, let's say if you want to write something on the chart, here's what you can do. So if you go to draw and then click on one of these markers, and if you click on the down arrow, you can increase the thickness of the marker. So you can use your mouse to draw things, or you could use like a tablet. I'm going to use a tablet, and that's probably why it's blinking so much. And so this is an A plus pie chart. So if you want to, you can draw on a pie chart. And let's uh, decrease the thickness. Let's make it black. So if you want to add something, you could do so. And then to delete what you've done, just click this arrow to go back and undo any uh, changes you've made. So that's how you can draw and write stuff on your chart if you want to, if you want to make it a little bit more interesting. Now let's go ahead and make a 3D pie chart. So if you click on uh, the graph, just hit delete, and then it disappears. So let's highlight these two columns again. Insert, pie chart, and this time let's use a 3D pie chart. So let's add data labels and let's use data callout. And we could change the style of the pie chart. So let's use this one. And so everything is here. We just got to edit the title. And that's basically it. So let's call it company expenditures. 
So now you know how to make a pie chart in Excel.